Hey guys, Thunderstead here, and today we are doing more Elemental Heroes. We're taking a look at new support we got that we didn't check in the first bit, and we got a new skill. We got this Hero Alliance. It's super easy. Just do 10 fusions with Jaden during this duel, so you don't have to activate it. Just throughout the entire duel, you can normal summon a Neos, so that's already pretty crazy. And then once you do normal summon the Neos, you send one card from your hand then you add a super poly from your deck or a poly a miracle contact or miracle fusion from outside your deck then you get two random neospatians in the graveyard from outside the deck weird part of the skill and you get a divine neos there and then uh you are some slightly restricted you can only use elemental hero monsters and you need at least 10 and you can only have at least five fusions and they must be elemental hero or neospatian or neos so uh we do match that i th i didn't even count i think this is 10 yeah clearly that's 10 over 10 or exactly 10 3 6 yeah 10 so perfect ratios here we're using super poly in the beginning i thought super poly was from outside of the deck but uh you need the super poly in your deck to pull it it's okay though we still run the miracle fusion to search it with the sunrise we're going three neos two brave neos it's really unfortunate konami did this now i'd rather have it two neos fusion and three neos with this new way to bring out neos but we are running three copies of neos we do have Wrath of Neos, which will send a face-up Neos you control, turn it, and destroy all cards. So these three cards are searchable with your Brave Neos destruction. So we have Sunrise, Brave Neos, Grand Merger gets super strong, Gaia is really easy to use with Super Poly, Elemental Hero Core is from Big Miracle Fusions, and then Escarado is really easy to use with Miracle Fusions. And with this skill, we're normal summoning Neos quite often. Brave Neos only takes a level 4 lower effect monster. Super easy with Polymerization. Also, guess what? We're using the brand new Elemental Hero Plasmas. Once per turn, you send a, or you reveal a fusion monster. We would reveal a Neos. Then you get to send a Neos to the graveyard. And this card becomes that sent monster. So then he becomes a Neos. You can super poly. You can fuse. Whatever you need to do, he'll be another Neos. So we essentially have six Neos on the field. Six normal summonable Neos. We can Wrath of Neos. We can fusion. Whatever you need. Then we have ways to search Neos. We're still using one Liquid Soldier. Some back row hate. Very streamlined. Very tight. Very good deck. It was pretty good. Very fun. Definitely gonna play it a little more. This is probably the way to play heroes. Maybe not three Prisma. I I don't know. Three Prisma works though. Maybe we get rid of the Miracle Contact. Go even more Wrath of Neos to really use the Prisma Neos combos. It's a crazy little crazy little deck with this new skill, guys. Definitely get this new skill and work it out. So I uh, hope you guys enjoy. And thanks for watching. All right, here we are facing a little Yugi. Going second, he was going for a rank up. He's using some Dark Magician little Yugi stuff. We're starting with Super Poly. We even have a Prisma. He's gonna go attack position. Delta the Magnet Warrior throws a Beta, sets to back row. We get a Prisma, so we're gonna start with Prisma. Prisma reveals Neos, mills the Neos. We are now Neos, so we can Super Poly steal his monster. Super Poly gets its own animation. Now we can use Neos Fusion and our boy Scoops. We could have Wrath of Neos if we had Wrath of Neos. We could do all sorts of stuff with Prisma for turning into Neos. Great, great stuff. All right, here we are facing a Jim Crocodile. We're going, did that say second? That's that second. We're showing him Hero Alliance. Neos and a Liquid. Liquid actually looks pretty awesome as a hero. Probably wouldn't be very strong, but uh, looks awesome. We're facing Trimids. They're pretty good. We get a Mystical Space Typhoon. We're going to hit the back row as a Floodgate, so very good hit. 
Stratos is going to search Prisma. Then we're going to Neos Fusion with the Prisma and the Neos, obviously. Swing into the Master. All he can do is bring out a Cruiser, not a threat to us. And he'll take another 1800. After our Neos, search another Neos Fusion. Remember, you can search a bunch with Neos Destruction. We could have searched a Neos Wrath, we could have searched Miracle Contact, all sorts of stuff. And here he goes with a Dancer, throws away a Field Spell, sends it back, gains some attack. Now she is Earth, so we're going to be able to Normal Summon this Neos we just top decked. On the turn you Normal Summon, or summon at all, the Neos, you get to add the Super Poly from your deck, or a Poly from outside your deck, or a Miracle Fusion or Miracle Contact from outside your deck. We're going to get the Super Poly from our deck, that's going to give us the opportunity to steal his monster for our elemental hero Gaia, that way we don't have to worry about any possible Sphinx hitting our hands. And uh, he scoops as soon as he sees we have all these big monsters. Great, great stuff, guys. All right, here we are facing a little Yugi. We're going second. Going for a rank up. This deck was winning a lot, no doubt. Got our super playing the Neos. It's already such a good hand. Even with Missile Space Typhoon, it's going to be a very good second turn. Even with our boy not giving us a monster to Super Poly now, he's using Buster Blader. So, no dragon in the graveyard yet, just a Buster Blader. He is an Earth monster, so we can already Super Poly with him. But we're going to wait for an even bigger monster to use the Super Poly as removal, because it's just such good removal. Now we're going to use Hero Alliance. We threw away Liquid Soldier. We gained some Neospatience. We got a Miracle Fusion. The Neos on the field and the Liquid, so we lose our Super Poly. And now we get Hero Sunrise. He's going to give us... Oh, we get Liquid. I didn't know you get Liquid from the Miracle Fusion. So we're going to chain Super Poly as he tries to book a Moon. Now we've taken his Buster Blader. And we have our Hero Gaia. Didn't want to use the Super Poly just yet. But uh, since we got the Liquid, we now drew into a Neos Fusion, and now we're threatening Lethal. So it was the Sound Play, but he does have an enemy controller. I don't attack to not give him Draw Sense low level. I've uh, gotta assume that's the only skill he would have on this boy that would work in uh, Buster Blader. So I don't give it to him. What does he draw? What does he draw anyway? He just draws the Whelp anyway. So he top decks the Whelp, throws it to the Graveyard which lets him fuse from the graveyard his Swordsman. Now we can't Super Poly Swordsman, he's a light monster, so not much we can do with him. He tries to battle the Neos though, we can stop that destruction with the Neos Fusion, and our Neos is in fact already over him. We're going to search another Neos Fusion, hit him with the Gaia, because now he can draw since low level, it's not gonna matter as much. He does exactly that, so I was right to play around the draw sense low level anyway, even though he just pulled the whelp anyway and we still beat it. Great, great stuff, guys. Alright, here we are facing a Sarah. We're going second. Another rank up about to be denied. She's 21 cards. We have to show them Hero Alliance so they know you're just bringing out a Neos. Our boy is super heavy samurai, so. With Gaia, we can take him out by any means, but we're gonna just swing over him. You'll see in a moment. Shooting Doji with a Fortress or Soul Shield. I don't know why I always call it Fortress. We get to just normal summon Neos. That's what this skill is. That's how it's OP and how Konami's trying to buff up heroes. Here he comes. Now the Hero Alliance lets us throw away that other Neos. We search a Miracle Fusion. Now we could have Super Poly, okay? Super Poly would have been a great way to do it. We steal the Earth. We use it with Neos, but I'm going to show you a Grand Merger trick. Because Grand Merger can get over this boy. And we have a Neos Fusion. Obviously he still has the Soul Shield Wall, which is going to protect him from an attack. But we're just going to swing with the Neos anyway and finish him off. Could have finished him off with the Super Poly and the Gaia. Probably much easier. Well, no doubt much easier.
here, but uh, I, want, I like the Grand Merger place to just really show you guys. So, uh, this deck's obviously really good. I'm so tempted to run more Wrath and Neos with this Prisma because it would just be so wild. We could probably get rid of the Miracle Contact, I would say. Get rid of the Miracle Contact, add in whatever else you want. Keep the heroes at 10 like this, even with Neil, so you can normal summon them all. It's so, so crazy, guys. Very good deck. Consistent ways to pull Super Poly. Crazy stuff. So I hope you guys enjoyed, and thanks for watching.